I'd like to see you at one of the doctor's meditations, Mr. Murphy. Oh, I'd be a very bad influence. My vibrations would be positively poisonous. You see, I don't hold with the theory that the fourth dimension is either philosophical or mathematical. I think it's purely intuitional. Oh? Hmm. I don't mean to start an argument or, or sound pretentious, but that's the way I feel about it. Well, you ever get a ten-buck raise? Yeah. How many of those guys in office owe everything to me? I made them. Yeah, I made them just like a, like a tailor makes a suit of clothes. I take a nobody, see? Teach him what to say. Get his name in the papers. Yeah, paper is campaign expenses. You don't understand. I could have had class. I could have been a contender. I could have been somebody. Instead of a bum, which is what I am. Let's face it. Comes back and sit down and holds it across his knee. The guy with the shakes is sitting right across the room from him. Pretty soon Lefty just touched the trigger a little. And the gun went like that. The rat fell out of his chair dead, and we drove off and left him there. <laughs> Come on, Tony, wake up. I want you to meet a new guy what's going to be with us. This is, uh, uh, Caesar Enrico Vandello. Oh, little Caesar, huh? Yeah, sure. We need spaghetti, too. And you lifted it from them. You're talking through your hat. The watchman you knocked off didn't die right away. He talked. He was off his nut. You're cute. I'm not cute enough. Thank God, this is where you live. Say goodnight to me and go on inside. Well, what's the matter? What's wrong? Will you stop asking questions? Go on in. Beat it. Yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, Good night, Rocky, and thanks for bringing me home. All right, Eddie. Rocky, please be careful.